Hello everybody, it's your antagonist, Big Fed Balloon, back with some more Animal Crossing. Last time, we visited the reef and saw it in its glorious state, quote-unquote. Or, well, I should say abandoned state, but it was nice to see it. And this time, we got mail. Hopefully. What the f- What? Bill! I literally sent you a letter! Why do you keep ignoring me? Anyway, read from Gladys. Hello, BFB. I saw this and thought it would really suit you. Please accept it. See you, Gladys. Press. Press. I don't know what you call them. Letter background, let me call it. The FBFB, he even for a far apart waste elf friends. I want this, but I don't like it. You can have it. I'm assuming that's one of the villagers. I think it's the duck guy. <laughs> yeah, that's actually cool because you got a letter from them. Huh. But yeah, let's see what the presents these are. Open sesame. A kitchen sink. And a mahjong table, which we already own. Yeah, talking about the mahjong table, I actually went back on to the reef, well, on my own time, just to see what they got in the catalogue in Nook Shop. I found enough, they had the gold economic chat I was looking for. So I actually got, so I actually will be able to complete the mahjong tables that I was working on. Okay, I'm a bit full and stuff, so I'm just gonna put some stuff away quickly and then I'll be back in a sec. Alright, emptied my inventory a bit, but now we can collect the first fossil. Hip hip hooray! Okay, guess we also got to water that which I just put away in my can I think, so but yeah, let's get this down quickly. And then we can have a nice fully grown red turnip to actually sell. So water, 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 water. Okay. Guess one other thing we should check quickly is how did the flowers do? Did we get any hybrids, please? Oh, hi Bill. You didn't send me a letter. Yo yo yo, what's up, bee monkey? You know I like to garden well. I did it all day and I'm beat. Is that why you haven't sent a letter? Yeah, Ducky, what did you need anyway? Oh, you're talking about the letter? I think I sent it. Why don't you check back tomorrow? I hope so, because if it's not here by tomorrow, I will be making good on my fret. Either way, tell me a story. What's up, Bean Monkey? Today, I'm in a good mood today, so I'm going to give you my candle. For free, Ducky. Here you go, Ducky. See, you can use it to burn down your place when you burn down mine. But man, it'd be nice if it didn't rain tomorrow. You know what I mean, Ducky? Hmm? Wow, you're afraid I'm gonna burn down my house. Of course I am. I'm a psychopath, and you do not threaten me. Okay, Ducky, man. Come on. No. What's I gonna know what that was, but no, that's just a withered flower. Which is sad. But oh well. Anyway, time for the normal fossil hunt. Oh! Huh. Didn't know you could actually run into dung beetle balls and just capture it that way. Kind of cool, actually. Oh. You're here. And look, it's Gladys! Person, I'd like to talk to you more. Well, 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 it's right you, Bee Monkey. Listen, it's not that I'm happy to see you, but it's already 8.30. And I had so much I wanted to talk to you about today, Stretch. So, uh, what can I do for you, Stretch? Tell me anything. Um, I hope I don't embarrass you, but do you have a favourite girl? 
Oh wait, you don't have to answer that stretch. Oh. Mm. How would I rank them? Mm. I think Gladys and Pinky. No, okay. Well, Gladys and you go a bit high for me. Freckles has soured my mood a bit because he just. That was a mean comment yesterday. And I think he's just been holding up on my own, just doing training stuff with Damien, so. I don't really know what to think of what she's doing right now, so. But yeah, second fossil. One more down to find. Oh yeah, before I forget, anything new? Wow! Oh my gosh. Talk to myself. Katrina told me that this pelican was a symbol for saving, because I'm not sure how I feel about that. But. Wow. A sparwing? That's actually kind of cool that we got that. Uh, yeah, okay. Hmm. You know what? Let's try Gracie's quiz. Darling, you're talking to Gracie, Countess of Couture and expert of styles. What do you need? Oh my, hello, hello. You're quite a specimen, aren't you? Yeah, you like my new haircut? Or did you forget who I am? Tee hee, but darling, what kind of tragedy struck your wardrobe? Hey, I like the clover in my hair. You're gonna need some serious fashion first aid stat. Honey, I know you're here to get your fashion Easter badge. Bye bye. Had you. <laughs> Honey, I know you're here to get your fashion Easter badge. You know it. Oh, darling, you must be getting some serious fan mail. Sweet thing, you're making me hard to give you a fashion Easter. What? Honey, you're here. You know it. Oh, because it's... Oh, because it's my mail's full. Uh, I want to keep... Okay. Wait. What do they store in now? I think maybe... Yeah, it was Bell's pick. Okay, let me store my mail quickly and I'll get back to you. You ever stop busting down doors first? Alright. Now let's do a quiz. Honey, I know you're here to get your fashion Easter badge. You know it! More and more people are getting embracing the inner map fear fashion maven. By the way, oh yes, let's see what's going on here. Glitches. Don't like the start with your measurements. God, this chest waist. Oh my, wouldn't it be hot if I used silky fabric? Oh, sweetie, time for a fashion pop quiz. Beauty isn't just like looks, you know. You also need to know your flair. Show me how saucy and savvy you are. Here's your first question. Which of following is the most beautiful? Pearl necklace. Oh, darling, get your bad self ready for question number two. When do you check yourself in the mirror? After a shower. Watch yourself, honey. Question three is coming away. You caught a hot sale. What do you got one for one area? What do you do? Bags. <laughs> darling, you'd be best to be ready for question number four. What's your stance on design and knockoffs? All about looks. And finally, people were sort of fighting for the same leaders. Oh, awesome! Okay, darling, I know where you stand in the world of fashion. Here's a present. As a proof of how close your sense is to mine. Oh, they're gonna get a dumb roll here. Ta-da! Oh, and hun, I just got one more thing to say to you. Ratchet, do you that country aroma? I'm sure she gave me a moldy shirt. Well, nothing, but... Read. Your grand virus. Gracie's got to pay her respects to your only to the only true fashionista. But hey, we can keep talking to you. Well, perfection, right? Everyone agrees, darling. Well, honey, don't you have a little more sachet to your step? Maybe it's because of that fashionista badge of yours. Bruce, you and I see eye to eye the most things, important things in life. Looking fabulous. Don't you get all uppity. No matter how close you get, you'll never be me. You get that? Darling, this world's only got big enough for one greasy. Uh, darling, you pulled this out and there's no design on it. I can coordinate now if it'll blow away your style rivals. Well, as if you want. You must understand that I'm not doing this out of the goodness of my heart. Oh my. The goodness of my heart? Now that's funny, honey. Oh, and I'm not asking for charity either. Well, let's do the usual 5,000 then, because I think that was the last one I did last time. But yeah. 
Oh my, so much, oh, I mean, of course, darling, tee hee hee. Honey, Grace is about to make you the deluxe. Ready? And go. Snip, snip, snip. Oh my, I could just eat this up. So balls are tangy, so spicy, and you got a bowl of BBQ going on here. Oh my, you're looking saucy up and a plate of Alfredo. I'm not sure if I like this, but... Well, let's add our own style to it this time. Let me get more close up to it so I can actually have a good look. What shirt am I even wearing, actually? Let's have a quick look. It's a little polka shirt. I think that's not one you sell normally, but... Yeah, probably sell the triangle shades, but... We'll, see. we'll have a look around at this. Have a nice look around at with this costume going on today. But yeah. Thanks for the dress up, Gracie. One, two, three, four, five, six, maybe not seven, but not eight, no. Too slow for that. <laughs> oh well. Well, I found the pitfall trap at least. Hidden behind flowers. Oh, how are you doing, but Dicky dog dog, bee monkey. Right now we're holding a little something something. And for you, I'd be really like going for just 1,570 bills. What'd you say? Are you in a barcue? Take the risk. <laughs> that's what I like to hear, barcue. I'm wondering if that's not something good. You better take extremely good care of my parlor wall. Oh no, because I'll be watching you. Yeah, and I hope you raise up the turnip prices, because we've only got one more day after this. And I've checked the ones for this afternoon. I did check this morning for both this and the reef, but I haven't had any good luck with that. Oh, look, there's the third fossil. Now we can get these to Blathers. How are you doing, Blathers? You doing good? Ah, uh, who indeed, who to you? Yes, you are doing good. Welcome to Voldia Museum. Yeah, we got some donations, so donate. A fossil, fossil, fossil. Ah, uh, yes, fascinating. Who oh, my, dear, what we have here is a seismic tail. But we already have that. Well, I might check, because I don't think we have that for actual fossil collection. Ah, uh, the second fossil, fascinating. Who oh, my, indeed, what we have here is a fun fossil. But we already also have that. Ah, um, yes, who indeed. The first third final fossil is... A Patera skull, but we already completed the Patera, so we can just sell that. Anything we don't have of the Patera in our actual fossil collection is the one of wings, which I think is the right wing, but... Yeah. Well, I'll see you around, lovers. Before we head to the shop, let's check out the kitchen sink because we don't know what that looks like I don't think that's actually kind of cool I think I think this is something Gladys would probably want for a lab but yeah and what does the parlor wall look like okay very pink which I don't really need so face normal back and I'll just show this off quickly but yeah we don't need those but yeah, I'm going to get to Nookington's now. See you later, Mr. Butters. Please tell me you have some good turnip prices today. Yes, welcome. We have our Spotlight product in stock today. Check it out, yes? We'll do, but... Cat, not catalog. Oh, actually, we do need to get something from the catalog, so... We can do a quick check. Okay, if I remember correctly, the stuff I'm looking for is near the bottom. There we go. Jade, we need to buy a second one, so... Yes, I'll buy that, thank you. Mm-hmm, the Jade economy jet. The price of that increased free shipping gets 800 bells. Would you like to order it? Yes, please. Thanks much. The moment you order a rise in store, I'll send it to you by mail. but you can't wait, hmm? Yeah, we're going to complete our game room a bit more. Currently buying turnips for... Uh, do I want to risk it? Uh, I kind of feel like I want to do it. Just because I'll have four more opportunities, but 
Yeah. If I get a better price than that tomorrow, I'll start. Spot item just arrived. Okay. And look at that. An R wing. Yo, keen eye, there's a spotlight product, the R wing. And Timmy's just wandering around in the circle. It's a bargain at 72,000 bells. So what do you say, say? Say. Say. Deal, say. Thank you so very much. Very much. Very much. Well, that'd be 72,000 bells. A good deal at price, yes. 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 Look at this comedy routine. So funny. Yeah, well, that's something new. A punching bag or sandbag. But, yeah, let's see. Um, we don't need a mix, I don't think, but... Yeah, actually, I'll buy this. That's nice, but probably sell it again. Still, kind of go where I've got an R wing of all things. But let's sell stuff that we don't need. Which is kitchen sink. We don't need another copy of triangle shelf, shelf shades. <laughs> we'll keep the candle maybe. Oh we no. Pile wall, do boop. We don't need that. Sandbag, tiki torch, mahjong table, and cabin table. 8,644 bells for everything. Thank you, thank you, 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 you. Is there anything else can we do for you, 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 you? But, no, that'll be all. Thank you very much. But, yeah. I'll try to leave Tarnets for now and just risk it all on the final day. Which is probably the dumbest thing, but we'll give it a shot. How are you two doing? Hey, welcome, welcome to the Able Sisters, where you are the fashion designer. Got any neat clothes today? Got a Viking helmet. Bye. Can you clown news? Oh, buy this for the meme. The eight ball. Eight, eight, eight. If you keep pressing it, you can keep doing it. How are you doing, Sable? What can be FB? Thank goodness it's Friday. So BB, will you be able to rest up tomorrow? I bet I finally got episode 30 edited, despite how I don't like how I recorded the ending, but otherwise all good. What's the fact? You don't want to know what I'm doing tomorrow? Nothing particular. I just like to be sewing and embroidering now, just like I do every weekend. Yeah, well, so off to close quickly. Yeah, I didn't make the same mistake as I did last two times, so. Boop, boop. Yeah, but, but I made a new mistake. Hip it hooray. Back you go in and done. Let's get our clothes back for cheap price. And that's all done. Thank you very much, Mabel and Sable. Keep up the good work. Great to see you. Come back soon, okay? Jason, how are you doing, huh? Very nice TV. How's your evening, Bee Monkey, going? I had about a million things I wanted to tell you today, but you didn't come visit this afternoon, so I'll let myself forget them, Pump Metal. Oh, you got your music up. Enough of that, though. You got something to say to me, Pump Metal? Got it. It's weird. I've got this bug about interior design that you, Pump Metal. Do judge, Bee Monkey. Any funny instruments? Come let me know with the quickness, Pump Metal. I don't think I saw any in store today, so. Sadly not. Hmm. I guess I gave you two of the same instrument, but hey, you got a violin as well. And you still got your nice fish and TV. You definitely need a bed, though. And also, your room's creepy with the TV on. Keep it on, just for you. Because you're probably watching football, I think. But yeah. See you later, Jay. Now, this is Pinky today. Doing good? Oh, you seem to have sacrificed one of your mole crickets. Yes! I only got two more to sacrifice. Can I be my give -out? Enough of those kid in the candy store rides. There's nothing here for you to take, one. So speaking of which, you probably need something from me, huh, Wah? Give me news. Be my I got a ton of new furniture you have got to see. It makes my house look like a bajillion, million bajillion times cuter. Look. Like, I know you got your mini diamond that I gave you last episode. Glad you got to keep that. High corruption, wire. Is she doing something for you or what, why? 
Ever since I saw the chic furniture at Tom Nook's store, I can't stop thinking about it. I still need some chic furniture. Someone will buy me some chic furniture. Do I have any chic furniture? You can have a candle. I crashed from what? So speak of which, probably need something from me, huh? Take this candle. I think this is chic. Wow, well, um, do you like it? Because I actually don't. The kind of collect cheek furniture, that's all. Take this bar. And I'm ignoring your last comment. So, yeah, just don't go copying pink, not pinky. Don't stop copying freckles. Or if you're the one that started it, don't set a bad example to her, okay? But anyway, see you later, pinky. Who's that? Oh, Gladys. How are you doing then? Um. Bee monkey, I got a strange question for you. Do you think it's true that the way you talk says a lot about your personality? Because I've been getting tired of saying the same thing all the time. I thought you might like to come up with a new catchphrase for me. Oh, thank goodness I can re redo for avoid the mistake I did last time. Right. Stretch. I think this is the correct way to spell it. So hopefully, I did not make any mistakes this time. So, do you think I should go running around saying stretch the proper pronunciation all the time? That's fine. Stretch. I like the sound of that. It makes me sound dignified. From now on, you'll hear nothing but stretch from me, stretch. Glad you like it then. Anyway, time to go into Yuga's house. Again? Why? Why does Telna keep doing this to you? What grudge does he have against you specifically? I'll be back with some medicine. Okay, Tom Nook, what grudge do you have against you that you keep making a sick? Welcome, welcome. Feel free to look around. Yeah, yeah. Where's your medicine? It's probably down here, there. I guess it beats some medicine. Well, look, it's quite a bargain, yes. Look, you have this huge empire of this entire building, and yet you still want to keep people making people sick. Well, of course, I could just show Timmy and Tommy how the business works. So I thought you you as a perfect example of getting someone sick. Just for example? Why, oh, yes. Man, you just suck. Of course I do. I'm a businessman. I must keep our business at all costs. Yeah, I'm going to teach you horrible things to children. Look, I hope those who grew up to be a best example of being good kids, okay? Because you are horrible. Horrible businessman. And I think they should have a bright future. Are you talking like a married couple? Nope, but I just want them to have a good future. And you stop making people sick. You understand? Right? No. Okay, then I'm done with this talk. Thanks much. Please do come again. We'll be waiting. Hmm? Yep, enjoy your extra 800 bells. Alright, Yuka. Let's get you some medicine. Oh, very cold. Can't stop shivering. Lipstick all over face. Medicine? What? Really? Uh, do you even solve your bed? Or is it just a sofa right now? Okay, okay. I think the worst is over now. Thanks, Bump Metal. Like, no, you don't have your bed. So, I'm going to give you a very important advice. Do not get rid of this couch. Make sure we get some blankets on it. And make sure you don't get sick. Again. Thanks to the medicine if your load's better. I have one person to thank for this, and that's BFB. Take care. Hey, you're a good kid, but metal. Again, don't sell sofa. Put blankets on it. Have a nice sleep. Get yourself wrapped up in this sick shirt if you need something. But yeah. Okay. Yeah. Still shivering. Okay. I'll see you later, Yuka. Okay, how are you doing, Drake? You doing good? Uh, good evening, Quacko. 
For some reason, I just got totally sleepy. I can barely keep my eyes open. So, anyway, what can I do for you, Quacko? Boredness. I'm not really fond of taking baths, Quacko. It's too much hassle. Even though you got a bath right in the middle of the room, my mom always told me to climb in the tub and count to 100. But somehow, I always finish in about 20 seconds. How long do you soak in the tub for? I'm gonna go a bit lower. So, you don't like baths much either, huh, Debracco? Technically, yes, I don't mind them though. But you know, if you just get half in and sit there for a long time, it's going to get all smooth without washing off too much dirt. Huh. Well, that's your advice, and maybe I will do one day, but. Yeah. Got any gossip? The other day I was dancing to blues while eating pear salad. It's a feast of dancing, but it kind of made my belly churn, Quacko. Hey, if you have any pears, will you give it to me? Please? I'll trade you an apple. I'll write a letter and trade you an apple. Will that be fair? Okay. Well, I'll see you later, Drake. How are you doing, Freckles? Wow! Bee Monkey, you scared me. You okay? I'm all good now you. I thought you might not come visit me today, but here you are, Ducky. Oh, right, 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 right. You wanted something, didn't you, Ducky? What's with the somber mood? Oh, nothing. Tell me anything. What? You're the one who designed this dress? I must have seen your name on the label and bought it without even looking. That's the last time I buy one of your hideous designs, Ducky. Right. What's up with the mean streak? Uh, nothing. Oh, hey. What are you trying to get through this? Got any nefarious plans? You rocking bee monkey? Listen, when you pop by my place the other day, did you forget something? Don't think so. Man, call it me impressed. You're so darn honest, ducky. Wow. But yeah, you forgot to do something, and if I don't see it tomorrow's mail, you'll be in trouble, as I said. Integrity ought to be rewarded though, so take my kitty rule. I should make threats like a kid. To tell the truth, I just don't want it anymore. I just want to keep trolling you. Again and again. Well, if you give that up, I'll do that and tell Damien about you. And get you in trouble. To what that threat is. Hopefully he's still sleeping. Alright, did we get the right proportions for Snowman? Oh, say hi, let's work for to be together like this. Seems like I've been waiting this brutal winter cold forever. Just waiting and waiting for a nice kid like you to come along and finish me. I didn't know what was going to come first, you or spring. I felt like one of them hamsters in a wheel just rolling in place. Oh, but seriously, I'm really happy you came along. Seems like I did a good snowman then. You know, I'm a really good looking snowman, but it's not like a snow lady in sight. This is a big problem. I wish I had a pair of legs or a phone or something. Well, if you had legs, you could come to my room and ring someone, but... Yeah. And I can't bring a phone to you because it's not New Horizons, so... Yeah, kind of doomed. Well, either way, just need to wait for New Leaf. Okay. I think what I'm going to do today... Just say we have something unique. So I want to start getting actual path done, because... This is the thing we've been holding off for a long time. Like, it's been probably like t over 20 episodes since we actually designed something, apart from the flag, but yeah, let's actually get into designing stuff, so I'll probably stop talking for this for a bit, and I'll try to have some, well, I don't know if I have background music, but I'll try to get through some design process and see what I can think of for Pathway, so I'll see you in a bit. Hey everybody, Future BFB here. Here I'll tell you about the design process I went through designing this path. Basically, I want to start off with some color palettes because I thought I could make a lava crack with the pathing, but I just didn't think it would work out, so I decided to stick simple and go with checkerboard patterns. I'm trying to do 10 by 10 pixels for each checker pattern. But the problem was, when I realized is, while the corner would work, the problem was that a long path, which is 32 wide wouldn't handle the 10 by 10 by 10 squares I would make. Alongside this problem, the other problem was that if we extended it further on, 
was the fact that the checkerboard pattern wouldn't even work even if we stretched out the squares because it would just be repeating so we'd have to create a whole different pattern and that was something I didn't want to do. So my plan was the outer layer for it would be a checkerboard pattern where we would have actual checkerboards and my original plan for the inside was to have one color darker, one color lighter on the bottom side but this gets changed in a future episode where I realize that mistake. But yeah, that was the design process of it. Hopefully we'll get we'll get more in design processes later on when we get to the actual episode where I finish off designing the paths. Still, enjoy the rest of the montage. Alright, I think this is a good start, but I want to see how we can get all the other connecting pieces look, so I'm going to create a second one just to see how it look combined and stuff, so I won't bore you with the process of that one, but yeah, hopefully this is all good. Oh Dan, so tell me what is the concept? Four more refined. All right. Top left corner. But that'll be all. Well, I need to continue on designing, but yeah. I'll see you all in a bit. All right. Let's give us a quick look and how it would work. Uh, let's go over to the area where we have a bunch of random, well, our uh, minion blocks. Let's see how it looks just burn on the ground, so do to do, won't go to pans. And we'll go here. Plop on floor. And plop on floor. Oh, design. Plop on floor. Hmm. Let's see how it doesn't look bad at all. Well, you gotta check yourself in the mirror. Here we go, Drake Boss. You got serious news? How is you going on, Ducky? What, oh, man? What's the big deal? Dude, don't you know anything about working out and getting huge? What the heck does a working out have to do with news that bark you? It restricts airflow. You'll never run a three minute mile with all that blockage, bro. And now you'll suffocate. If I were a ref, I'd throw a penalty flag in your flag, you're meat ahead in this. Oh, at least you At least you didn't get too angry at it. Hmm. Alright, but... That looked nice. The problem is, I want it to look nice, so... Uh, yeah. Honestly, I think this might be something I just work off screen, because... This just seems like it's just going to be lots of fiddling around to see how I want my paths to work. Should also get some, maybe some texturing as well in a bit. But I think it's a solid base for now, I think. I think well, I don't want to do inside corner pieces. I think if I want to do that, I, well, just describe what I'm trying to do. Do I have a description? Do I have a plan that would help describe this? Yeah, I think about the middle part of a path, where it's like cross section. I want to do a bigger version of this for that. But otherwise, I just want to have a very simple pathing so I don't have to worry too much. But yeah, this is a good start. But I think I may do some more complicated designs off screen, I think. And then I'll just show you off later. As long as I think design works, just going to take forever and I don't want to do huge recordings and stuff. But yeah. Let's head to the brew and have a nice relaxing end. But I don't really know what else I want to do with this episode today. How are you doing, blabbers? And you're about to head off to your ship. <laughs> Can't believe I have to go to work after this. Do you understand all? Do you? Uh, hello? Fine, just do what you always do, you slack jaw. Indeed. Care for a cup of java to pick you up? 200 bells. What blend would you like? The usual. 
whatever you say. Yeah, I gotta get some practice for when I have to burn down Bill's house. Then what up comes one hot coffee favorite brand? Pigeon milk. Care for a little pigeon milk? Draw. Sure. I think you're gonna be very pleased. In it goes. But yeah, Brew. If I if Bill doesn't write me a letter, prepare to give me all your coffee ready on standby. There we go. At the perfect temperature to bring out the flavour. 176 degrees. One freshly brewed cup. Brewed cup. Thanks, I will. That's sweet and mild. This can be uh, none other than the world renowned pigeon blend. You know what? I'm gonna go to the shop and see if there's anything Freckles might like. Yeah, there right you are, Freckles. So uh, you want to chat with me some more, right? Yeah, I like to chat with me too. Oh, all right, right. You want something, didn't you, Ducky? The big fishing tourney's coming up, and I'm not close to being ready. I really need to be a practice for a big look at eye. I got totally worked out when I said a beady little ice, Ducky. Oh no. Well. I'll get mail delivered for the first one. Alright, Billy, before your shift ends about 15 minutes, I got some letters to deliver. So, here you go. This is the window for the town post office. What can I do for you? Mail letter. That's going to... Not that one of us, but... Bill, last warning from BFB. I'm not move over here. And then Drake. Dear Drake, you talk about having a pear pie, so I was wondering if you had any pears left. If not, don't worry. Either way, thanks from the BFB. But yeah, those are the two letters I'm sending out today. Thank you. Do you have anything else you mail? No, that's all, thank you. Alrighty, we look forward to you serving you again. Main thing recycling bin. Nothing. I guess that's good. It means we don't fill up our inventory. Okay, you ready to talk, Freckles? You seem very down for some reason. And angry. Hey look, it's 2146, my favourite time! Yay, numbers! See, I'm not sad or angry at all. So speak of which, you probably need something for me, huh? Gossip, Bill and Pinky, they show adorable, then the same organic miso soup. Nothing's even wrong about that, Ducky, right? You're just ignoring the question. Guess you haven't got your quest up. Gossip? I mean, you should totally take this, Ducky. It's this book called Cottage Farms Revealed. It's a bestseller. This book is like totally passionate, Ducky. Oh, this isn't like the right one at all. Oh, I said stupid dang it, Ducky. What's wrong, Freckles? Nothing's wrong. <laughs> no, something's definitely up. Like, did dress Drake with a mess review? Not Drake, Bill. Uh, no. I know I'm right here. I'm pretending you're not. But just talk to me, Freckles. Hey look, it's 2447, yay numbers! You want something? You monkey, your house was it's really got big, ducky. Tell now it's just okay, popping in whenever, but now I'm a bit nervous. What's up? Uh, uh, okay. Look, you know the fish I used to have? Yeah, you put them away, right? Like, release them to the wild? Uh, no. See... I was actually just putting them in storage while I was just moving stuff around. And then each time I did, they would just disappear. Oh, gone, and I don't know where. Huh. I was just... I don't know who to trust anymore. Like, you could have took them because you're angry at me for the fishing tourney. No, I'm not angry. I'm more happy to have a competition with you now. Oh, okay. But still, as a housewarming gift, should I bring expensive miso soup for you for 
forgiveness. Well, of course, there's no way you can fold something like that. Ducky. But, yeah, I, I don't know what happened to your fish, but I'll find out, maybe. I don't know, but just, can we just be friends again and not get angry every time? Okay, well, i also give you an old school stuff when you need it. Well, I'll talk to you one more time. Just in case. Best friend, Ducky, so speaking of which, you probably need something, right? Oh, well, be monkey, hey, be monkey, house Ducky, what's that going on? It's got so big. When you model your house next time, build me an exercise room, okay? Sadly, that will probably not happen. But, yeah. I'll see you around, Freckles. See you around! But, yeah, Freckles' fish going missing? Huh. That just sounds like more plot stuff going on. But yeah, with that, I think I'm going to end today's episode. We at least got some small stuff done, even if it's not anything major. But yeah, with that white flash, I'll see you all next time for... I don't think the fishing tourney's tomorrow, but we'll see what happens Saturday. At bare minimum, we got a KK Slider concert, so I'll see you guys then.